If you're planning to take a road trip somewhere, Google Maps can figure out the fastest way there in a cinch. Although if you want to take the longer, more scenic route, you're going to have to take a few extra steps. So if you want to create a custom route from point to point on Google Maps, here's what you can do. The easiest way to do so is via Google Maps desktop site. Start by heading over to maps.google.com and entering in your destination using the search bar provided. Once you've found the right place on the map, click on Directions. At the top of the sidebar, choose your method of travel, then choose a starting point by searching for one using a starting point search box, or by finding and then selecting a point on the map. As soon as you do so, Google Maps will suggest the shortest viable route. If you want to avoid things like highways, tolls, and even ferries, click on Options and take all that apply. Google Maps will automatically recalculate its route. To add in a stopping point or a landmark to pass by, click on Add Destination, then search for and select the point using the provided search box or by simply clicking on the map. Feel free to add in as many additional destinations as you want. You can reorder all your stops by clicking and dragging on the dot displayed before the stop's name. With your stops anchored in place, feel free to zoom in on and adjust the route itself by clicking and dragging the route through where you want to go. Before you make any changes, the route places a white dot wherever you need to make a turn at. Once you're satisfied with your custom route, you can share what you've come up with by clicking on the triple lined icon on the top left, then by clicking share or embed map. A window will pop up with a shareable link you can use to save your route. You can always have your route sent to your smartphone by clicking on send directions to your phone. If you created your map while signed into your Google account, Maps will show you a list of devices that you can send the route to. If you are not signed in, it will ask you to sign in to proceed. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Google Maps and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these other videos we think you might enjoy.